Hello you guys and welcome to the first ever episode of Trading Tips and in this series I'm just going to be showing you guys how to trade on FIFA 13 Armour Team and I'm going to be going through a lot of um, trading methods uh, and how to do them. So um, the first method we're going to be going through is the 1-2-3 method and you're going to want to go to your player search as you can see I've already set this up. Uh, your level want, wants to be gold, you can have all of the rest as any. Uh, your minimum price will want to be 10,000, your maximum price 20,000 and your buy now minimum price will want to be 30,000. So once you've got that set up, you're going to press search, and you will find quite a lot of um, good players that are going for quite cheap. Um, as you can see, there's a, a few Balotelli's going there, we've got a Torres, a uh, Suarez. As you can see, mo most of these players you can probably make a bargain on. Uh, it's best to do this like, um, at, like, late at night or um, early in the morning when there's not many people online, as um, there'll be less people to contend with them in the bidding. Uh, and yeah, so... Um, once you've got this up, you can basically search through here, and you can find some cheap players. Uh, as you can see, there's a few uh, informs. You find quite a lot of informs this uh, this way for going like quite cheap. Um, also, don't, also don't forget if you do forget the price, you can always go on the ultimate database, and um, they'll have a um, average like price that a player has gone for on that specific day. So if you see like um, just using that as a, this is a plain example, I don't know his price, but if you find Adriano, you can see he's going for thirteen thousand five hundred. You also open up a new tab called ultimateDB.nl. I'll put the link in the description, and you say his average price has been going for about twenty thousand. So you can probably bid up to about eighteen, nineteen thousand before you um start losing your profit on the tax. But um anyway, once you won that, you just sell them up again, and you've made some profit. Easy, easy done. Um, you should just go through this until you probably get to an hour or something, and then um I'd recommend um basically stopping for the night and I'm trying again in an hour or so um, the best time to sell these players would be uh, when a lot of people are on because that is when the average price will be uh, you can you can get um, sell players for a lot higher when not many people are on if there's because um, there's obviously less of them in the market but you can also um, find bargains uh, at that time as well so um, at night uh, and early in the morning the prices do vary a lot up and down so um Expect price to be a little bit different um, throughout the daytimes. So now I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please do leave some feedback in the description and I'll uh, not in the description in the comment section and um, I'll greatly appreciate it. Thanks, guys.